At the October 10th We Robot event, Musk was all smiles as he unveiled and talked up the safety of their new Robotaxi Cybercab, saying they'll be way safer than human-driven cabs. Meanwhile, did you know the ancient Greeks had a nifty device called a hodometer to measure the distance traveled by chariots? Many see it as the earliest version of the taxi meter. Now fast forward a couple of thousand years and Tesla's chief Elon Musk is making a grand entrance at Warner Brothers Studios in Burbank, California, unveiling something even Zeus might envy. From the looks of it, the cybercab is taking us one step closer to living in a real-life Jetsons world. Who knows, flying taxis might be closer than we think. Or maybe they're already here. China claims flying taxis are ready for takeoff, but we'll get into that later on the channel. But one thing Mr. Musk probably didn't mention is how much we'll miss those taxi drivers who entertain us with wild city stories. Will the robo taxis match the warmth and enthusiasm of Jose? Elon Musk has become the master of surprises, each one promising to push humanity forward or at the very least to create a buzz on X. This time he's zeroing in on the taxi industry, aiming to disrupt it with Tesla's latest innovation, the Cybercab. But if it feels like you've seen this robo taxi before, you're you're not mistaken. The Cybercab borrows its edgy vibe from the Cybertruck, though thankfully, this version boasts smoother lines and a sleeker design. Think less tank, more futuristic cruiser. And while the Cybercab seems right out of a sci-fi movie, one that detective Del Spooner from iRobot would definitely appreciate, it's not Musk's only vision for driverless transport. Tesla is also working on the RoboVan, a larger autonomous vehicle aimed at group rides and cargo, adding yet another dimension to Musk's push for a driverless future. At first glance, the Cybercab shares the distinctive angular design language of its sibling, the Cybertruck. The resemblance is uncanny, but look closer and you'll notice the purposeful differences. The extended wheelbase, the larger passenger doors and the optimized interior space all point to one thing. This vehicle was built for the taxi industry from the ground up. Step inside and you're greeted by a spacious cabin that puts passenger comfort first. Musk's vision is a lounge with many screens where cyber cab riders can enjoy funny videos or movies or even do some work on the way. The idea is to free up time and improve safety according to Mr. Musk. But here's where things get really interesting. Tesla has integrated their revolutionary wireless charging system into the Cybercab. No more plugging in at charging stations. And when the vehicle needs a charge, it simply parks over a wireless charging pad at designated spots around the city. This continuous charging approach means more time on the road and less time at charging stations. Under that sleek futuristic shell, the Cybercab hides cutting-edge tech. The Cybercab is equipped with advanced self-driving abilities, meaning it can zip around all by itself. It even uses AI to figure out the fastest route, saving you time by avoiding traffic jams. It also promises a special climate-controlled storage compartment, perfect for delivering food without it getting cold or too hot. And using Tesla's latest FSD or full self-driving technology, the Cybercab can navigate complex urban environments with unprecedented precision. Yeah, better than Jose or Joe, your favorite cab driver, but without the hearty laughs of course. Elon Musk believes the Cybercab and other autonomous Tesla vehicles are set to be game changers when it comes to safety. He explained that autonomous cars should be 10 to 20 times safer than those driven by humans. The math behind it is promising. More technology, fewer accidents. In Musk's words, this is a very big deal. It will save lives, a lot of lives, and prevent injuries. The Cybercab will rely on an AI-driven system that learns from data collected by millions of Tesla vehicles, enabling it to respond to road situations faster and more accurately than most humans could. Tesla's approach is unique. Instead of using pricey radar and lidar sensors, which are common in many self-driving competitors, Tesla is relying on advanced cameras combined with AI. These cameras, backed by Tesla's extensive driving data, train the Cybercab to see the road, recognize hazards, and react instantly. But as with any high-speed metal machine, there are concerns. Experts like Samitha Samarniaki from Cornell highlight that safety still has to be fully guaranteed, especially with the system relying on cameras alone. While such features can be impressive, they may not be fully foolproof. In some unfortunate cases, errors have occurred, such as an incident 
earlier this year where a motorcyclist tragically lost their life in a crash involving a Tesla allegedly using FSD. Safety concerns have led Tesla to recall its driver assist systems, as government scrutiny over the company's autonomy claims has increased. But with CyberCab set to launch in the coming years, Musk remains optimistic about its potential to redefine safety on the roads. For now, Tesla is pushing forward in states like Texas and California, hoping to secure regulatory approval by next year. And with the CyberCab on track for production by 2026 or 2027, Tesla aims to make safe, fully autonomous travel an affordable reality at just around 20 cents per mile, compared to $1 per mile for city buses. If Elon Musk is to be believed, Tesla's autonomous all-electric cybercab is designed to eliminate some of the taxi industry's biggest costs. With zero fuel expenses, minimal maintenance needs, and no driver salaries, the cybercab promises to reduce operational costs dramatically once full autonomy is achieved. Industry analysts predict this could cut the cost per mile by up to 60% compared to traditional taxis, creating an opportunity for lower fares for passengers and higher profits for fleet operators. However, investors are still on the fence about Tesla's ambitious robo-taxi vision. Tesla stock dropped over 8% after Musk's announcement, while shares of competitors like Uber and Lyft, both pursuing their own autonomous ventures, saw up to 10% gains. Skepticism remains around Musk's optimistic timeline, with production slated for some time before 2027. Musk acknowledged his tendency toward optimistic timeframes, but he's aiming for the cybercab to start at under $30,000. Industry experts, however, doubt that Tesla can achieve such a low price point without external subsidies or taking a hit on each vehicle. Despite these challenges, Musk envisions producing a massive 2 to 4 million cybercabs annually across multiple factories. The cybercab's design itself is a leap into the future, featuring doors that open like butterfly wings, a compact two seat cabin, and no steering wheel or paddles, relying solely on full autonomy. Without the need for a driver, this purpose-built vehicle promises higher utilization rates, reduced insurance costs due to advanced safety features, and even wireless inductive charging doing away with the need for plugs entirely. However, the CyberCab will face a strict regulatory path before it hits the road. With no manual controls, it will require approvals in each market Tesla hopes to enter. And with competitors like Waymo and other ride-hailing giants racing towards similar goals, the CyberCab's success will depend on Tesla's ability to keep up with its aggressive timeline and deliver the transformative impact Musk promises. And if it does, the cybercab could redefine what it means to hail a cab and set a new standard for urban transport. Currently, Tesla is trailing behind companies like Waymo and Cruise, which have logged millions of real-world miles with their robotaxis, gaining valuable experience and data that's essential for refining their technology. This delay could impact Tesla's readiness to deploy its cybercab, especially as the industry has already already seen a few missteps. Robotaxis from various companies have faced incidents like blocked vehicles, traffic jams, and even minor accidents, all of which raise valid safety concerns. Tesla will also need to overcome stringent regulatory challenges, which are ramping up as federal safety authorities investigate whether these autonomous systems are safe enough for everyday use or should be subject to recalls. Approval for fully autonomous vehicles will require clear evidence that these systems can reliably operate without human intervention. And that's not an easy task with the current tech. Public trust is another hurdle, as people must feel confident in sharing the road and even riding in a vehicle without a driver. The enthusiasm of Jose the cab driver may be worth the premium for some people, which may be a good thing. Also, urban areas may need upgraded infrastructure to support widespread use of autonomous vehicles, especially if Tesla and others want to prevent situations where robo-taxis unintentionally clog up city streets or misinterpret road signals. Despite these hurdles, Tesla has a history of turning bold visions into reality pushing the boundaries of what technology can achieve. If the cybercab can navigate these challenges and prove its worth, Tesla may indeed have a shot at reshaping the future of transportation. But until these issues are resolved, the dream of a smooth, autonomous ride still has a few bumps along the way. The question isn't really, will it disrupt the taxi industry? The question is, how quickly will this disruption happen? And based on what we've seen, that future might be closer than we think. What do you think about the cybercab? Let us know in the comments below, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more cutting-edge tech coverage.